How's everybody doing? Uh, we got a uh, got a new hot rod here on the farm. We picked this up actually off of uh, off of Craigslist of all places. Uh, guy up in uh, Northwest Missouri had it, and we got it bought, and uh, we actually stole it. Really, I mean, compared to what they this tractor would sell for or is listed for on tractor house um we got it bought super cheap it's a a 98 model uh john deere 8400 um really super clean tractor uh it's got a it's got eight eight thousand i think it's eight thousand hours on it um pulls our disc and our harrow really well and uh it's got a chain there i think dad was using it to pull somebody out but uh it's got four remotes on it there close those those don't need to be open but super clean really clean well taken care of machine um it's got the big the big donuts on the inside uh it does it is gonna need a new set of skins here for too long and some some LED lighting is gonna be a must, but uh, climb up in him and pretty clean. Floor's a little muddy, dirty, but dad, he, this is, dad runs this tractor in the fall on the grain cart, or he will be, and he just, he just uh, parks it in here and lists, listens to the radio and sits in the AC, but, uh, no, this thing is um, this thing is really uh, really a neat neat tractor. I really do like it. See what it's started up here for you guys. Shut the blower off so you're not getting that. Crank it. Cranks over super good. Starts all every time. I mean. Um, it does, let's, let's see here. It's got 8,000, let's see that, 8,295 hours. Um, it, uh, it's super strong running tractor. It, um, the only thing I do not like about it is that uh, it, um, it power hops. It gets to going down the road. It power hops really bad. Um, I do not. I do not like that about it. That's where I really, really like the uh, ILS on the front of that 8310R. It uh, it really eliminates a lot of that. But um, but no, I just I really do like this tractor, and uh, um, I like it a lot for especially for what we paid for it. I mean. You couldn't, uh, I'll tell you this, it was under 50,000 50, and it was closer to 40 than 50. Um, and you can figure that out. But uh, no, it, this thing is damn good running tractor. And I don't, we've had it for a while and I just haven't done any videos on it. But uh, do a little, a little drive of it. See what you, give you guys a little, a little tour here. Sounds really good, runs really strong, doesn't burn any oil um, in it at all. Uh, we um, had to uh, wash it when we got it, and it needs a needs another coat of wax on it. But we really, um, really need to put up a barn. Uh, it's just something in the works. I can't can't get it. You know, can't get it all in the. You know, all in one year, but uh, no, just needs to needs to be in a barn, and um, so we can keep this paint looking good. But when it does sit outside, we we try to keep them waxed, and that way the sun, you know, is not tearing the paint up too much. But um, but no, just I actually really like this tractor. It's it's big enough to pull anything you want, and it's small enough to hook it on a, a bat wing mower and, and go mow. I mean, we pull a thousand bushel grain cart with it and no problems at all, but uh, no, 
I just uh, really do like this tractor, and I, I don't think you guys have seen this yet, but just figured I'd give you a little tour of it.